Hi everybody, my name is Greg Patterson and over the next few videos I'm going to show you how to develop 2D and 3D trend visualization products. Now for this exercise we're going to use ArcGIS, we're going to use ArcGIS 10 and we'll, we'll need an extension with 3D Analyst. We're going to receive some ASCII text files and we're going, going to have to convert that into a shape file. The ASCII text files will contain X, Y and Z values. In this case we have Easters, Northers and a height value. After we convert it to a shape file, we're going to convert it from one datum to another datum. The first datum um, is HD66, it's camber grid, and we're going to convert that into GDA9904. From that we'll create a tin, a triangulated irregular network, and we'll visualize that in 3D. So we're going, get, we're going to require ArcScene to do that. We're going to drape the imagery over top of the tin and in there we can actually do a fly through. From the tin we'll generate a dem product and produce all the other products from there using the tin, uh, the dem. We're going to produce contours, hill valley shading, conduct some slope analysis, produce an aspect, produce aspect data. This data will show what's north, south, east, west facing for the land. We'll do a, create a terrain profile of the land. We'll look at line of sight to see what areas are visible when you're looking from one point to another. And this is great for micro, um, such things as microwave towers. Later on, we'll also get into producing a view shed to analyze what's visible or not visible, like a radar prediction. And finally, we will produce an aspect slope map. So combining both the aspect and the slopes. 